What is going on guys, Kickabout Gaming here, and today we're going to be talking about what I love and hate about Paladins. We're going to be starting out with what I love about Paladins, because, well, I love Paladins, I really do like Paladins. So, starting out with the first thing I love about Paladins is the general concept of it and what they're doing. I like where it's going, and I love the art style and stuff like that. So, yeah, it's just, it's overall where it's going is pretty good. Uh, second thing I love about Paladins is the character design is amazing. It's flawless in that game. They look amazing. High, they look high resolution. Uh, the third thing I love is the art style in general. I love the cartoony kind of wash art style. I think it just looks really nice. It's really light on the eyes. Um, I think Overwatch is still better though, in terms of like how it looks. But you know, it's it's gonna be like that. Okay, so. The, I think this is the fourth thing that I love about the game. I'm an idiot. Uh, the fourth thing I love about the game is that people, the community, is actually not that bad, and people are quite nice in the games. Um, but I think that's pretty much all I love about it. I pretty much stayed it. Oh, the music. The music. I'm not gonna lie, is pretty damn good. Uh, menus are nice. It's clean. The shop's amazing. The skins are really nice. So yeah, there are what I love about the game. Now on to what I hate. I hate the new Grok. The new, if you don't know, Grok got pretty much reworked where his basic attack has like fucking no charge anymore. So it's like, and done. His right click is now shit. It's a ball and you can barely even see what it does. I much preferred his old ability because it was just fun to use. Um, I really don't like Grover. I still feel like he's overpowered. I just don't like him in general. Um, Victor, fuck Victor. I do not. I hate Victor so much. I've pl I've played him a couple times in games, and I feel dirty for playing him. He is f hands down the cheapest, the, like worst excuse for an FPS game. Like, how do you even come up? I understand they needed someone, more people with guns, but. They added an assault rifle that he can sprint, he can throw grenades, and, and, he can fucking aim down sight, which makes him a hundred times more accurate, so he never misses. That is so annoying to an Androxus, because when you're flying up, he can just use his iron sights, boom, he's on to you. Instead of an iron sight, why couldn't you have given him, I don't know, like, something he can use else, like, I don't know, like an ammo refill or something, or medkit, or something like that, because we still need a heal a proper healer in the game. I'm waiting for that high res. Uh, but yeah, so I just hate Victor in general. Third thing, Bomb King. Fuck that guy. Even though it's been patched and he's not as powerful, he's still extremely annoying to play against. Playing anyone, playing Grover, Sky, uh, I think Ruckus as well, and Androxus, and maybe some others, I'm not sure. It is such a pain in the ass because you could be, say, rushing the payload, and he's freaking round the corner, and you have to get up close to do any damage to him. So you you go around the corner to try and take out a few guys for your team. Say you're Grover, you all oh, you kill a ton of people. Bomb King's just sat at the back lobbing arced bombs, so he just has to aim up a bit and throws me, throw him as far as he wants. He hits, he got, he gets four stuck on you. Say you've already taken a decent amount of damage, like I don't know, like. Let's say 400 damage from everyone else shooting at you. Say that's how much damage you've taken. He will then detonate those four explosives and instantly kill you. I just think it's overpowered and annoying as hell, especially when he sets up traps on the payload. It's just annoying. I really want them to change that. But yeah, so my next thing I hate is... Uh, the fact that they didn't, they, this was supposed to be Global Agenda 2. Yeah, so if you didn't know, guys, this was actually supposed to be, um, like a Global Agenda 2, but they changed the project mid-thing to be something else. But it, it's just, it, it's just overall, it's just kind of a waste of a game, because I, I still hope they make a Global Agenda 2, but I don't want it to go in the direction that Paladins Five, is going. Because Paladins is going more for a... Two, kind of smite kind of thing because since their recent like success with smite they've been trying to like emulate that more so i had to do that i had to do the emulate thing yes okay moving on to uh just like ideas and concepts that i have for the game 
I would love to actually see a medic in the game. Someone that heals, someone that has an ability like Aphrodite from Smite, where she can attach to someone and give them an extra buff. Like, I don't know, they get like, they get better cooldown or something if they're in Paladins. And they could have like one of the, they could have their ability, one of their abilities to heal, maybe the ultra global heal. Or maybe it's like, I don't know, like a, a giant, like a, you put down a bomb that heals allies and po and like does damage to enemies. I'm not sure, like something you can put on a wall or something. If an ally runs up to it and takes it, that's health for them. But if an enemy runs past it, it explodes. That would that'd be kind of cool, I'd like that. And the, I don't know, the sidearm, or not the sidearm, but their main weapon would be like a pistol or something. I'm not sure, but it, I just think it'd look cool. It'd be cool to have a fucking medic class. Um, also, some maps. Oh, I forgot to mention. I fucking hate the maps. They look nice and they're pretty, but I just hate them. I don't like them. They don't fit with the game. You can't make a payload sister. It worked for TF2, but that's because TF2 had such a varied cast. This is a varied cast, but they all run pretty much at the same speed. Unless you buy certain things and build them certain ways. And it's so pointless. Like, instead of making such big maps, make them a little bit... Make them, instead of being like large maps, because they are pretty big and they are nice, I will admit that, they do look nice. But, like, bleh, m mechanically speaking, they don't suit what's... They don't suit the game at all. Uh, but yeah, so I just think they should make smaller maps. Smaller maps, a medic class, maybe another sniper. I'm not sure. I don't. I'm. I'm not too fond on long range. Guns. Maybe another melee character actually, like a guy that runs in with an a, a dwarf that just runs in with a fucking pickaxe and one of his ults like he fires gold out of his ass or some some. That's like the idea of having a dwarf that runs in with a pickaxe and beats a shit out of people's knees. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be fun if they had that. But yeah, so there's just a few ideas I uh, have for Paladins and what I hate and what I love. Uh, if you guys disagree, leave comments, let me know how you feel. So yeah, so thank you guys very much for watching, and as always, Bon Voyage, motherfucker! <laughs> Doop 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 do